hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, welcome to the Vibe Tribe family. It is Friday and that means it is Starry Night collab with Nicole from Chronically Crafty. And in today's video, we're going to be talking a little bit about taking better care of our bodies. And I realized I'm not taking very good care of my body still. Oh, oh and it's a little squirrely. I'm a little squirrely. It's also a short video today. Sometimes it's nice to have some short ones. So if you're not already subscribed to my channel, I would love it if you would stick around and join the Vibe Tribe family by hitting that subscribe button. If you like today's video, make sure you hit that thumbs up as it lets me know I'm on the right track for creating content. If you don't like it, that's okay. I don't mind. Not everyone's cup of tea. Don't forget to hit that notification bell as it lets you know when my videos upload. And right now I'm uploading six, sometimes seven videos a week. All right, let's get into the video. Hey, hey, everybody. How's your Friday going? I hope everyone's having a great day. Sherry here, aka Diamond Art Addiction. And we are here for our Starry Night collab that I am doing with Chronically Crafty. Today, she is going to be giving you guys some facts on kidney disease. And I'm going to chat a little bit on how it's important to take care of your health. And that's something that I didn't realize until a few years ago when my body started to fail me. And if you hear my voice is a little raspy today, I'm pretty sure I am getting a cold. And when I get a cold, it's always my throat that goes first and then I get the rest of the fun stuff that comes with a cold. So I do apologize for the raspy voice. And before I get into too much of today's video, I just want to say thank you, thank you, thank you to the people who donated to the channel from yesterday's video. I truly appreciate that. You literally brought me to tears. Thank you. And again, it's not expected or a must. I just, I want to say thank you to those who did. I truly appreciate it. I want to make sure they know that I am grateful. Okay, let's get on with, let's take care of our bodies. I'm not going to sit here and preach about taking care of yourself and what you should and shouldn't do. You know, we're all grown adults. We all can take care of ourselves. I didn't take care of myself that great, my health, up until I, my body began to get really sick in 2017. And I pushed myself to keep working. I didn't listen. I'm like, oh, it'll go away, you know, because I didn't want to disappoint or upset anyone. So I stayed silent for a long time until it got to the point that I could barely even keep my head up at work. And then, you know, I knew it was time. I had gone for some tests. And, you know, I, I didn't do all the tests. Okay, I'll be honest. I'll be honest. I didn't do all of them because spinal taps scare the living crap out of me. I was supposed to get the spinal tap and we never, I never went because I'm a chicken. <laughs> but yes, I'm going to get the test done. Yes, I'm going to get the test done. I'm not going to chicken out this time, I hope. I know it's important to get it done. I've got to beat the fear. And I can do that. I just, it's, I know it's mind over matter. And it's only going to hurt for a couple of seconds. It's just the idea of them going into my back again with a needle after what happened in my last childbirth with the epidural. Yeah, no. <laughs> but I, I know I need to get it done as well. It's not fun when our bodies are failing us. But have we failed our bodies? And what I mean by that is I never took care of my body the way I should have. 
I didn't eat properly. I still don't eat properly. You know, I smoked for 30 years. Yeah, 30 years I smoked. 29, because I quit at my 40th birthday. So a little over 29 years I smoked cigarettes, plus all the drugs that I put into my system when I was addicted. You know, like, I didn't take care of myself at all. So it's no wonder my body is starting to fail me. <laughs> I don't blame it. I don't blame it. How, how do I get upset at it, right? It's still frustrating, but I'm starting to, like, you know, I've quit smoking. I've been trying to eat better. I've been going for little walks, not big ones, little ones, because my back is still pretty pooched. But we need, we do, we, like, Literally, like, when I sit here, even as I'm filming this, I'm like, wow, I still really don't take that great care of my body. You know? Like, yeah, I've cheated, and I've had some cigarettes here and there. It's, it's a hard habit to kick. It's hard when I get around my family, because my family smokes. If I don't go around my family, I'm fine. But the moment I get around them, I, I smoke. And... Khaleesi, no, it's not supper time. Squirrel, sorry, my cat distracted me. I was talking about, yeah, smoking, you know, it is, it's a hard habit to kick. I just need to be strong and not smoke even when my family does. When I get stressed out, same thing. You know, I, I want a cigarette. And I know it's the worst thing to put into my body. One second, folks. Oh, and I'm back. The cat was distracting me. The cat was distracting me. So it's been a few minutes. And I know, like, I'm saying, like, you know, we got to take care of ourselves. Like, that's the hell. Because, you know, when I look at chronically crafty and what she goes through with kidney disease I couldn't even imagine like what she's all and I'm all worried about one little needle going in my back you know it almost makes me say give give my head a shake give my freaking head a shake because she goes through hell with kidney disease and I couldn't even imagine. It's almost like she's going to become my inspiration for wanting to take better care of myself, for wanting to go get that spinal tap done so I can get the final diagnosis. Like, even though they already know, they're pretty sure due to because of the MRI, they just, it's best to have that spinal tap done to make sure, you know, and... I need to do it and I know I need to do it so I can get on to treatment because I know I've like right now I can barely hold my diamond painting pen see like it's I'm struggling to hold it because I've got numbness and tingling in my hand and it's not the carpal tunnel it's a different so I've got to kind of hold my pen like this so I don't drop it. You know, and then I look at health nuts, right? Like someone that a lot of people knew had a heart attack this year and died. And he was in his early 30s, healthy, fit, and just had a heart attack and dropped. You know, it's, and then there's some people who don't, aren't healthy at all. And they can live to the ripe old age of, you know, 80, 90. So it makes you wonder, like it all makes me wonder, how healthy is healthy? Like I know it doesn't mean go sit there and, you know, pound back double quarter pounders five times a day or anything like that. You know, it's, it's not good to have extra weight on. Yes, I have extra weight on. You know, it's not good to smoke. And I can honestly say I vape more than I smoke. I don't smoke very often, not at all. 
do I eat healthy? Not the greatest, you know, and I am sitting here getting ready. Now that I'm, now that I'm filming this and talking about it, wow, I really don't take care of myself at all. <laughs> you know, and maybe this is a little bit of a wake up call. If I do seem distracted during this video, I do apologize. Tomorrow is Xavier's birthday. So I'm a little bit distracted today. I will not be uploading a video tomorrow. And then Sunday, I am going to start getting us back on track by uploading in the mornings again and not late in the day. I need to get myself on a better sleeping schedule because the one that I'm on right now is just not good. Nope, 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 it's not. So I definitely need to get onto a better sleeping schedule. Insomnia sucks. So you will not see a video tomorrow, but you will, you know, you'll, you'll see one on Sunday for Spiritual Sunday. Tomorrow is Xavier's day and I'm taking that day to be alone and by myself and do what I need to do. I'm going to have my son with me so I won't be alone alone. But I usually like to just, this year I'm just going to diamond paint. I'm just going to diamond paint and do my thing. I have my sister coming over tonight for a little bit of Friday Friday night fun. In other words, we're going to diamond paint. <laughs> that, that's fun for me. Like <laughs> It's fun for me. As you can see, I've gotten a little bit work done on Starry Night. I do need to work on it a bit more, so I may work on this over the weekend and see how much I can get done. It's kind of fun, like working with these special stones, like these rhinestones, the crystal stones. It's different and it looks fun. It is fun, but it looks so much different than when you work with regular drills. I'm enjoying it. Tot whoa, squirrel! I totally squirreled off the healthy topic, didn't I? I don't know, like I said, I just kind of realized like I'm still really not taking care of my body the way I should right? I'm really not. I'm really, truly not. That was a big squirrel. Holy. <laughs> this video is probably going to be pretty squirrely and I do apologize. My brain is not all there and it is because of what tomorrow is and it's okay. It's a good thing. I enjoy, I'm going to enjoy it this year more than I have any other year. And for the sake of my children that are here, I do need to start taking better care of myself you know, eating better, not smoking at all. Like, you know, having a cigarette here and there is still not good. I mean, I've quit a lot worse things than cigarettes, so cigarettes shouldn't be so hard for me to quit, but they are. <laughs> I mean, I haven't had that many, so it's not like I'm being a total arse with smoking. I'm not. Mr. Addiction would come unglued. So, so yeah, like... I know Nicole, Veronically Crafty, is giving you guys some kidney facts about kidney disease. And then down in the description box, we'll have tons of links that you can check out for kidney disease. And anyone who makes goes to Treasure Studios Art, and orders from them. I am donating all of my commissions from the moment this video goes up until Sunday morning when my next video goes up. So up until Sunday morning, I will keep track of any commissions that come in. It all goes to the Kidney Disease Foundation. So this is gonna be a little bit of a short one today. I realize I need to take better care of my body. I only have one. You know, by talking about it made me realize that I'm really not taking care of my body. So on that note, I hope you guys enjoyed this quick, short video. It's not that long. Sunday will be a bit longer as I will touch base on with you guys on how tomorrow goes and talk a little bit of spirituality. Okay, I look forward to Spiritual Sunday. I hope you guys are having a great Friday. Much love, light, and blessings. Stay positive, live blessed, and until the next time, bye guys. Hey everyone, editing Sherry. I told you the video was squirrely, so 
your giveaway question. We kind of have a giveaway question. I almost forgot to do the giveaway question. So your question for today is, do you prefer rainy days or sunny days? Which is your preference and what do you like best? That will be worth one entry into the draw for the giveaway. I will see you guys Sunday morning. Have a good day. Told you I was squirrely.